Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Mansa Reddy, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please take a moment and subscribe. And this video is not being sponsored by anybody because uh, I don't think I'm yet there. Early in the morning, I think if I have time, one of the things that I like to do is clean up the room. Cleaning the room makes me so happy. Trust me, guys. Hey guys, so I just took a shower and right now you saw I cleaned up the whole room because usually whenever I get a chance to clean up the room, I think that's like a priority because I feel like if you don't have a clean atmosphere, you cannot really concentrate and achieve what you want to do. Like my mind doesn't work, you know, whenever it's like messy in the room. My first you know, priority would be like, let me clean the mess and then think about what I can do next. I'm very, very happy that uh, maybe I think two or three videos back, I actually told that I'm not really happy with the way my workout is going on and I have come back. I did yoga like for uh, six days continuously every day morning, 30 minutes and then I went to my work. And now recently, just like maybe two days, it's been two days that I got back to the gym as well. Uh, I'm not going to a, a gym outside, I'm just doing gym at home and uh, like we have a private room for gym. So I'm just going there and uh, I just run for a bit, do a little bit of stomach exercises. I think that's like the main, main thing that I want to do because uh, I don't know, I just get so carried away looking at, uh, especially all the K-drama girls, I think they have such girly, cute physique and which I don't think is possible for me because I think my body type is different anyway. But whatever is the best for my body type, I think I'm trying to do that. And I follow Holly Docky and her exercises really work. Like you feel that pain, you know, when you're doing the exercises, you actually get pain in your tummy, you know, on your arms and all. Yeah. And a lot of people have been asking me, if this is a vaccine. Like a lot of people have asked me, like, is this a vaccine? No, I, it's not a vaccine because I'm not a, a frontline worker, nor I'm above 45 age, so I'm not yet eligible. Definitely, yes. After May 1st, I will get my vaccine, first vaccine. Today's breakfast, usually I had oats or I was having, uh, what is that? Sprouts. Sprouts, yeah, I was having sprouts for uh, breakfast. But recently I have come down to eating my school time habit, like I would eat um, I don't eat rice much, I eat uh, wheat rava, it's also called dalia in Hindi and I eat that with uh, either curd or the yesterday's leftover curry uh, which is perfectly fine for me because uh, I actually grew up eating that kind of breakfast for like many many years, for about 10 years. So I like that, it feels really full and gives me that energy to, to go through the day. Like I said in the last video, Shubram is not at home. He is uh, staying at a farm, he's learning natural farming. I'm just waiting for him to come back home. But also I'm so happy and I respect the fact that he is uh, living the life that he wants. You can see right at the entrance, they have the mannequins dressed up in leopard print. Animal print, I think, is like a fashion that keeps coming and going. One of the things that I see very frequently come back in fashion is definitely leopard print. If you move a little bit ahead, you can see there's a collaboration with a designer. And this collaboration is called Lem Lem. It has all the beach vibes. Oh wow, these actually look like towels, but they're scarves. The scarves that you can uh, lay on the beach and then sleep over it. Or if you're wearing a bikini and you want to cover yourself. These are like, you know, those big scarves. And also I'll show you some other random stuff that you might like. A few years 
years ago i used to wonder what would people actually wear inside these kind of blouses they're so tiny they barely cover any of your body and you cannot wear anything inside them because everything is like visible outside but now i think i figured out pretty much what you should wear inside any garment uh let me know if you want me to make a video in which i can talk about what you should be wearing inside uh different types of garments silhouettes so that you avoid those lines coming out of the skirts or you know your straps being seen out from your strap tops stuff like that hey kitty hello i'm just videographing you please cooperate hey i'm back from my work and my day was good usually my days are good because i think it's all about your mindset like bad things do happen and sad things do happen it's all about how you're able to take it and i was talking about shubham in the morning i'm very 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 happy that he has taken this uh, decision of going and learning natural farming because i think i need to respect his choices just the way he accepts my choices and i give him his space because he gives me a lot of freedom a lot In fact, he supports me in every single thing that I do. Um, more than I do to him, definitely. Not sure why only Hyderabad is not under lockdown yet. Maybe it will be. I'm guessing because that's how it looks. And um, yeah, I also have to tell something about my hair. So I usually keep doing, you know, something or the other to my hair, like always, like always. So what happened at the last time I did smoothing so something very terrible happened and my hair got damaged like maybe in the videos it's not that visible but if you actually look at my hair outside you can notice there's a lot of frizz in between not in the ends my ends are absolutely fine but somewhere in between there's a lot of frizz uh <laughs> it's because I'm not sure like maybe the product was on my hair for a long time or um, it it just failed sometimes treatments fail right something like that happened but whatever it is I am suffering actually because of that I know it is bad to do treatments like I said I always tell anybody that what you do with your hair with your body all these treatments and you know I know there's a there's this whole thing of telling people who do plastic surgeries or something that oh she's fake or you know she's not accepting herself uh well people are doing makeup like if you see at level 1 if you see plastic surgery to be like level 10 you must understand that i think level 1 is makeup the uh, you're using lipstick you want to enhance your eyes you are using kajal or this already a lot of not acceptance of yourself right over there because if you're ex- if you want to say that i'm accepting myself for what i am maybe you co- you should not alter anything in yourself it's your body damn you have every right to decide what you want to do with it hope you enjoyed the vlog it's almost sunset and i will see you next week until then bye bye